configure multiple access points on the same WLAN in Netlink HG3 to 21 DONT. First, connect Netlink HG3 to 21 DONT on the PC. Then open your web browser. Enter your IP address on the URL. 192.168.1.1 A dialog box will appear. Type your username and password. Enter verification code and click on the login button. Then select the network tab on the left side. Network settings options are available here. Select the 5G option. Then scroll down and select the WLAN multiple BSSID settings option. Click to enable the AP1. Go to the disable WLAN interface option and Click to disable it. Then you can change the SSID name in the SSID option. If you want to hide Wi-Fi, you can select the button Cancel Broadcast. This will give you more security in places where you have a lot of Wi-Fi networks. But those who do this must be able to add Wi-Fi manually. Then click the Submit button. Back to Status page. Click the User Info option. The newly added SSID name can be seen here. Then configure the access point. Click the network tab. Select the 5G option. Then scroll down and select the WLAN security option. Select your SSID name. Then choose your encryption mode. Then click pre-shared key. Enter your new password. You can use Lanty passwords including characters, digits, and special characters. Click the submit button. Here, the new access point is configured. Then create another access point. Go to the WLAN multiple BSSID settings option. Click to enable the AP to select the disable WLAN interface option and click to disable it. Then you can change the SSID name in the SSID option. Then click the submit button. Back to status page. Click the user info option. The newly added SSID name can be seen here. Then configure the second access point. Click the network tab. Select the 5G option. Then scroll down and select the WLAN security option. Select your SSID name. Then choose your encryption mode. Then click pre-shared key. Enter your new password. You can use Lanty passwords including characters, digits and special characters. Click the submit button. The two access points are configured. 
then back to status page and logout. Then open your PC network and internet settings page. You can view the newly created access points here. Please subscribe our channel and also press the bell icon there for getting notifications. Leave a comment.